All right, welcome to my Cursed Sales Quest Part 2 Challenge Guide. So this is an interesting screen. I don't think we've ever had event challenges that literally popped up a screen saying, hey, you've got new quests now. Maybe the initial quest, yes, but never Part 2 or a later part. This is weird. It says, take what you can, give nothing back, Jack Sparrow. So let's go to the quest here. It says Pirate Code 2, damage players that have damaged you, 500. Damage opponents with the flintlock pistol or travel distance from its knockback. Drink potions in different matches, so you have to play at least three. Raise the flag on the floating island. That one can be assisted. Speak to a character before taking damage. So none of these are really hard. I think the hardest one is definitely raise the flag on the floating island, and that's only if you play solo. If you're in duos, trios, squads, then obviously you can have more help up there. But if you're just playing solo, only one person per match can get that. And remember, a pirate's life, which is all just plunder gold, and the discover quests do not count towards leveling up the battle pass. They simply give you XP and that's it. So we pretty much need a flintlock pistol, which is super easy to get. In fact, you can talk to Mr. Davy Jones over here and buy one. And we also have to speak to a character before taking damage, so that counts for that as well. So here he is right here. Hey, I got a big pot as well. Let's talk to him first. He says, I am the sea. So there's that quest done. Let's go ahead and drink this. So let's buy the buried treasure. All right, there's X marks the spot. So if you weren't aware, you always get a bottle and a ship mythic, a flintlock pistol, and healables. Ta-da! There's the flintlock. Okay, so now we only have 13 shots. So I wonder, can we blast ourselves up and then boost with the mobility and see if that counts? So I've got it tracked. You can see I'm at 75 out of 500. Let's try that. Oh yeah, that does count. You can see I was still progressing. Well, that's interesting. What if we shockwave up, then shoot? And then boost. Okay, I'm sure there's a better way to do this, but that got us some pretty good hang time there. Oh, the fizz too. Okay, okay, I'm dumb. So let's fizz first. Then shockwave. Then do that. And then boost. And boost. And boost. Okay, so that was a lot better. Okay, let's fizz, and then we'll jump up, and we'll boost, boost, boost. Yeah, so this is pretty easy. All right, there's two AIs over here, and we do have to damage players that have damaged you, so you can just walk up to them and let them hit you, and then damage them. So hopefully they don't eliminate each other, so we got to see which one hits us first. Hit me, buddy. There we go. Okay, now we'll do the same for this guy. He's already hit me there. And we're at 306 already. That's pretty good. You know, I wonder if that's going to work versus a boss you can challenge, like Cerberus. Let's just try that out real quick, because you could do a ton of damage to him after he damages you. Oh no, this guy's already fighting him, I think. Wow, I just got absolutely shredded by that guy. That anonymous superhero smoked me, but I got the challenge done as well. So now really all we have to do is raise the flag on Floating Island. I bet that would have worked though. So Oscar as well as Cerberus, you can challenge both of them for their mythics. And I think if you let them damage you first, you could get that done instantly because you can deal over 500 damage to both of them. So someone try that out and let me know in the comments if that works. Wait, the medallion guy's over here. See if he has EMPs. Oh wow, we hit him good. The chase is on. Think you can outrun me, sir? Oh, I think he does have EMPs. Yes, he does. Miss. Let me try again. Oh, 
Oh, we missed. So those are the two good guys running right there. Maybe only had one EMP left. Ha! Wow, he had everything we need. As oblivious. What was he doing? All right, no way we don't capture the floating island now. No way. He's got you a piece. Heep. Wait, what? Why did he just get hit by? Where are all the rifts? Okay, this is dumb. I don't see any rifts. I can't tell if this guy's capping the flag already. Okay, no. Nobody has capped the flag yet. This is going to be quite the battle for it. And unfortunately, they removed the ability to capture it underneath. Oh, he's on top there. Crap. This guy tried to chase me. Not today, big fella. Not today. I'm capping this flag. Whether I... Oh, he's already capping it down there. No, we gotta get there. Holy crap, we took some damage there. These guys aren't playing around. I gotta get to that loot island. How am I gonna do that? Oh, he's almost got it capped. Darn it. It's like 99% capped. This is how I thought it would be. This is crazy. Luckily, I keep regenerating. Oh, that guy's gonna get it. No, 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 no. I was so close to capping it, I had to run it for a second. No, I was so close. He's still up there. No! All I had to do was kill that guy. Wait, did he not cap the flag? Hold on, I don't think he did. Hold on. I honestly don't think he capped it. I'm gonna go take a look. I'm taking the med kit just in case. I swear that says uncapped. Come on, come on, come on. Did he cap it? Oh my gosh, I gotta wait the full time? It's gonna be a five tick. But this is worth it. 
This is worth it. I can't believe that guy didn't cap it. I thought it was like 99% done and all he had to do is step on it. I might die here, but it's going to be worth it. All right, pop in the med kit. Come on, give me another med kit, please. Yes. I'm going to pop this. Oh, it's going to be close. We made it! And we did it! Let's go! Okay, those guys are fighting right there. That, that guy's got to be weak. Let's go take a peek. Oh, wow. Got him out of the air. We're in a 1v1. Well, he's coming in full force. So there we go. We did it as anticipated. That capture the flag one was absolutely the hardest, but that's just for solos. If you're with a team, it'll be much, much easier. So nothing too difficult in the Pirate Code 2. We get the Pirate Code 3 quest in two more days. So there you go. That's all there is to it. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. A like is always appreciated. And don't forget to use my supporter creator code, which is TaborTime.